the Cambridge Institute for Sustainability Leadership has developed a leadership framework. Um, and this, this framework is really uh, some of the cutting edge thinking in, in the industry today. And it brings together a whole range of different insights, both from um, scholarly research, but, but also from practitioner experiences and, 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 and tests them and is evolving uh, uh, these over time. It's a, it's a compelling organizing um, framework that, that people will be able to draw from to deal with the leadership challenges of leading in a complex environment, which the 21st century uh, really does uh, uh, present as something of a challenge. So as an example, in, you know, in, in our real estate business, we see disruption in the market as uh, you know, the government uh, puts in place uh, um, uh, regulations that says if, if the energy um, uh, efficiency of buildings is not achieved at a certain level beyond a certain date, uh, landlords would not be permitted to let out those properties. So at first, you know, if you if you don't have this kind of leadership orientation, as you would see, one can see this as just a risk and, and a negative. But when one, uh, uh, you know, expands one's thinking and looks at it in terms of a broader application, one can see commercial opportunities within that uh, a regulatory environment in which, it, it, rather than just limitations. And here we see an example where there is an opportunity in the real estate industry for banks to fund energy infrastructure upgrades uh, for buildings which increases uh, you know transaction activity and and returns for for shareholders for clients and and, and for the bank but at the same time supports an improved uh, 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 um, energy environment for the country through a, a, a decarbonization of, of the property footprint of the country and you know if you have this orientation and you lift your head up and you think more broadly, uh, then you're in a position to see that uh, the changes, the challenges and the changes required to address the climate crisis and, and, and inequality um, can also be commercially attractive. And it's not an either or, but it's rather a both and. And that kind of complexity thinking is what leaders need and, and the Cambridge Institute's uh, uh, um, leadership framework really underwrites those competencies in, in a very compelling way.